Hello everyone, today I'm going to be taking a look at the Gold Zero Yeti 200X and I'm going to be showing you guys what things this power station is capable of powering. So the first thing is any USB device, here we're plugging it into one of the two 2.4F USB ports, it comes in handy and don't forget to turn on the USB outlet button. Another common thing here we can plug in is an AC device, here we turn on the AC and we're plugging in a computer charger but make sure it's under 120 watts you don't want to overload the system this thing is great for emergency uses here we can plug in a printer i'll turn on the ac and then just plug in the plug and you can see that the printer is working perfectly fine no problem one common thing many people want to plug in is their camera charger so this is perfect for backpacking or camping you can easily plug in a camera charger but just keep in mind that with the camera charger in, depending on the size, it may block both the USB-C and the USB port on the right side, so just be aware of that. I found reports that the AC port stopped working after using an extension cord, so I recommend not using one just to be safe. If you do come into a blackout or an emergency situation and really need to plug in a lamp, this power station is very capable of doing that, just make sure it's under 120 watts. For a camping or a road trip, this power station is perfect for powering a 12 volt fridge. Simply plug in the input into the fridge and the 12 volt into the 12 volt port and just turn on the 12 volt and you can see that the fridge is up and running. The USB-C ports are perfect for powering things like the Goal Zero Sherp 100 AC, cell phones, or even laptops. But keep in mind that while using the 60 watt port, as well as the 12 volt cigarette and the AC port, the fan in the back will run and it's pretty loud. A USB desk fan is also perfect here. Just simply plug in the USB port into one of the 2.4 amp USB ports, and then power up the fan here this is the old polar fan i'll put links in this video we have and you can see that the fan is up and running with a powerful glow one thing this power station is perfectly capable of powering is the goal zero light lights these are chainable lights it can be used in the outdoors you can chain them and the output for the six millimeter port when you plug it in is 120 watts so you'll be sure to power these for a long time and to chain a lot of them the Yeti is also capable of powering a desk light or a desk lamp like this Aki LTT8. I'll put a link in this video we have here. Make sure to check that out. You can see that the light works perfectly fine. This light has multiple functions including color mode, warm light, and a cool light. Keep in mind for the AC port, it's kind of hard to take it out. You have to put some force. You can see that it won't come out easily as would a regular AC wall outlet, I have to put some force and pull it out. Keep in mind that the bottom prong, the third prong is actually fake, so anything you plug in will still work, but the powerful things will probably not give out as much as power or will probably not work. Overall, this Yeti is perfectly capable of powering many things such as a mini fridge, lights, lanterns, and multiple devices. I think it's a good buy and check out our other videos of the Yeti 200X to see how it functions and how it's tested. Thank you everyone for watching. Please make sure to subscribe if you haven't. Like the video, comment down below if you have any questions or if you want to see anything more about the Yeti 200X. And check out our other videos involving the Yeti 200X and other camping gadgets.